Hey guys, this is Seth here with another episode of Terraria. We're gonna open this and ooh, ooh, we has a ball of blue moon. We got this. Okay, how am I gonna do this now? Um, what can I get rid? I don't need that. I don't need this. I don't need that. I don't need that. You know, I should have put these items away. I don't need that. So now I can pick up all these. And I'll even go ahead and take this with me. But cool, we got a blue moon, guys. I figured I might, might as well. Why not? Let's go ahead and get that. I'm pretty certain we'll get another key. But now... get moving so yeah we found our first uh, chest here everybody oh god oh god oh god I got cursed there wow I didn't even know the oh boy oh god there had to be in Freaking spike ball down here. Wow, that's a lot of angry bones. I think this is the first record out footage inside a uh, dungeon in 1.0.6, I believe. Oh, we got a golden key. Yeah, that skeleton. What are the odds? Oh my god. How did I get through that without only getting hurt twice? Cool. Okay, H, H, H. That's how do you drop down. And what is down here? Wow, this is a huge area. Holy crap. And there's a heart in a dungeon, nonetheless. Even though I don't need it, <laughs> it's no point in it. Ow. God, these angry bones are going to be what do, do me in, I think. I gotta move down a bit. Oh my god. <sighs> and you know what I just realized? I could've used the grappling hook again. So you mean to tell me I gotta go all the way back there again? <sighs> well, at least we have a gold chest, and we found, we st I still, we have three keys, but I want to get my money. I want to get out of there n normally, people. That's not the way I wanted to get out of that dungeon, so we're going to go back there. There's got to be an easier way to get back to that dungeon. I hate taking this long trek every time. I'm really beginning to regret even making a large world now. At least now we know we can travel into the dungeon with ease. A positive note, no, we can even put the ball of hurt away now, so we have a better, an upgrade of it. Which I'm sure is just, it's just, it's just wonderful. But yeah, we now have a blue moon. And technically we can go take that golden key and put it and use it on that island too. So we'll go ahead and do that real quick while we're over here as well. Um Ow. But yeah, I think we're uh doing great, guys. I we have now trekked into the dungeon. We only found one chest, though, and I'm gonna have to make a long trek just to get back to my coins. This time, though, I'm not even gonna go back down there. Now that I know, I can just drop down like this. I'm gonna put my coins away. Because I need to. There. 
I'm gonna pull over here so that way I can just do this. I had to go through all those items, but there we go. Oh, Jerry Cole is here too. That's a first. I think this is the first time you've stumbled across the stream, actually. I think. No, you were on early before. But, um, whoa. Yo. Just playing Terraria, we're at episode 101. And you're in luck. You're about to see the very first floating island I'm gonna get, and see the very first item I'm gonna get. Um, what else can I do? I need to convert all these... Why can't I actually... Why is it I cannot... I don't want more torches, I got enough of those. I got golden keys. Let's go ahead and move to the other world and get to that other, uh... That first island we stumbled across earlier and couldn't access because we didn't have a key, but now that we have keys, having beaten Skeletron, we can now actually see what is inside that chest. Which means hopefully I'll actually have what I need, which I'm excited for because now I'm finally able to get some of the items I need for those. I'm going to put the other two keys in the uh, chest of my own world. Oh, oh boy. So that way, we don't have to worry about, uh... You know, so that way, we don't have to worry about any, um... We can separate which keys I'm gonna use for floating islands, and which keys I'm gonna use for, uh... The dungeon. The dungeon's not gonna be something I'm gonna figure out immediately, by the way. It's going to take a while to navigate, but once I get through it all, I'll have a bunch more items. That blue moon's going to help a lot, but here is our little floating island that we stumbled across. I'm going to get over there as quickly as possible. But we should now be able to get into it, I think. Lucky horseshoe! That's what I wanted! Yay! Yay! Oh, that was recorded, dude, by the way. Um, anyway. Yay! Copper. Lucky horseshoe! I don't know what I'm going to replace it with, though. Probably this. Yeah, I'm probably going to... I need that, ho that horseshoe. As a matter of fact, did it just take up a... Did I just lose two keys from that? Oh, well. Save and exit. People, we got a lucky horseshoe. I'm not going to die from fall damage anymore. Lucky me. We are not going to die from fall damage anymore, because it negates it all. Now that I have a lucky horseshoe, I will not have to worry about fall damage anymore. Thank fucking god. That is the number one thing I wanted, you know, to equip. And we even got a few more potions out of that too, but yeah, we're going to be going back to... There's uh, two other items I can get. There's another one that increases my height, too. The, my jump height. Which I could really actually afford. But, um... Yeah, we have a lucky horseshoe now, guys. That's the number one item I wanted from the floating islands, is the lucky horseshoe. Like I said, now I won't even die from falling. Which means I can, now I can jump from far away height and go, just be all risky and... It's so great. There's still stuff I'm gonna need, and I see the clothier is up in his, uh, house now. There's still stuff I'm gonna need, but I'm gonna put this golden key in here. And then, I'm gonna put these in here. Put these in here. Uh, I'll keep those. 22 range damage. Very fast speed. Consumable material. Really? Pretty cool. I'll keep those in there just in case, though. Um, dirt will go. That little piece will go in there. Mushrooms I'm keeping. Bombs. I'll 
put away. Gel, I'll keep. Sticky glue, six, I'll keep. Orb of light. Why didn't I use that, actually? Now I think about it. Um... Jurkins, I don't think I'm gonna need that. At least for the time being. Um, I'll put away these bars too. Stone I'll put away. And the wood I'll put away. We now have more room, which I do need. I'm going to be getting a lot of items in that dungeon. But we're gonna be going back down in there. I want to get a few more. I actually did announce I was streaming. You know, for a... Uh, for that. I, I did announce stream before. It just was... I, I like surprising keeping you guys, you know... Guessing. I like, you know... I don't like, uh... I just, I like, I just like keeping you guys guessing. I don't, you know... Don't you think it's interesting to uh, look look on here and every uh, a lot and see, you know? Oh, I wonder when, if he's streaming right now. I gotta go check. You know, you guys might be bored or something, and then you think, oh, SSF might be streaming. Well, let me see. And if you see, if it turns out I am, we hooray! My life is yeah. That's I just like surprising you guys. You never know when I'm gonna stream, but. Like I said, here's a general guide. I generally like to stream either late at night or early in the morning, because that's usually when I get less interference with uh, interruptions and all that. But you will see me occasionally, you know, like right now, it's quarter to six at my on quarter to six at night on my end. And uh, do I need anything else? I'm keeping this ball of hurt, a blue moon now. This is awesome. I wonder how much damage this does. Yeah, we're going to be going back towards the dungeon again, because I was not done with it. Plus, I have money to get back. I realize I skipped rotten chunks, but I don't want rotten chunks. I, this corruption just gets in my way nowadays. Luckily, it's not a very, very long corruption. These guys don't startle me as much, only when I don't expect them that they startle me. That's the only time they actually, you know, get in the way. Yeah, now that I, I can just make big, giant jumps and don't even have to worry about getting hurt because of it. I can go up to my maximum height with this, and I won't even get hurt. See? I think I would have gotten 60 damage from that, now I don't even get anything. That's how wonderful this critical that lucky horseshoe is, and it's going to be really critical when going down. And I can just make long shafts too, and jump down long shafts. I won't even have to worry about getting hurt. You know, chasms I make. It will make it, things just getting more and more convenient for me, guys. It really is. There's still one more critical equipable item I want. And again, I'll have to go to an, a floating island for that, but I think we'll be able to get it. I'm pretty certain of that. We're gonna go ahead and continue on with that other world, because, I mean, look, I found a floating island there, finally. And I want to start a new one, because, since there are only three islands, I believe. But, yeah. Alright, see you, Jerry Cola. Right now, I'm just, uh... Gonna continue on to the dungeon. It looks like we may not make it in time before I have to stop to deal with a time limit again. But hey, to have a hundred episodes is pretty remarkable. And to find a floating island at last was a huge gift. That is something I really, really wanted. The thing is, we still have two more islands to explore to get two more... Uh, floating out on the exclusive items, so I want to make sure I carry key and get those keys. But it's going to help a lot now that I actually have keys and can actually get some. You know, without having to worry about, you know, getting through Skeletron, so... 
Well, it hurts, still kind of a pain. It's not exactly... It's not better with the sword. Thing is, this is a lot... This is more ranged. Ooh. Oh, a star. I still don't see the uh, point in getting Fallen Star. Fallen Star. Wait, there's a chest down here? Did I already get this? Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next. Ooh. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Sign our guys.